Hello and welcome. This video is for the world boss, Khan. And this time, he is changed. He's on land. Or on an island. So what we're going to do is show you the steps of what to do. Everything appears normal. You head out to your port, get in your ship, uh, auto to the location, and this is where it changes. When you hit the point where you're going to spawn in, and even the loading screen looks the same, you're like, is it different? But it is. When you load in, you will now be on land with your character. So a lot's going to happen. I'm going to explain what I know because this is the first time it's happening for me as well. So cons out there in the center, there are two, three sets of cannons, uh, or four, two on the right, two on the left. But the first thing you need to do is clear out the monsters that are near the cannons. There's black crystal seaweed that's way off in the distance in front of those cannons. And there it is. It's been destroyed by another player. So you need to clear that and the monsters. And once you do that, then you can get access unless somebody is already working on it and you just want to jump in. You can now shoot the cannons. It doesn't look like you need to point them or maneuver them. You just uh, click auto and it will hit its target. I thought you did. Maybe you can. We'll find out. But it gives you updates. You know, catapult reinforcements are under attack. That's on the other side of this island. So uh, if you want to help out, get over there, battle those monsters. I noticed that the monsters came back where I'm at. So I want to help out and destroy them. So what we're doing is we're making our way to the other side of the island so we can see what that's like. And killing everyone along the way. I'm sure the other players appreciate that. So here's some monsters back here. And it looks like uh, top right corner of your screen catapult power. It looks like uh, you know it's really important to get over there to save the uh, catapults. Uh, maybe that's players. I'm not certain, but uh, it went up instead of down. <laughs> So what we're doing is just killing and getting over there to check out what that's like. There we go. And I thought we could use the catapult. You know, I'm sitting here looking to see if I could trigger it, uh, activate it, or anything of that nature, but I guess not. I guess it automatically happens. And uh, the Trina Knights are helping you on this fight. So it looks like there's guys See, Trina Knight's cannons. There's guys automatically firing out there. So, I guess I took one of their cannons. <laughs> and if you didn't know this, when you're fighting a world boss, sometimes it looks like, ah, oh, his health isn't going down. But when you actually engage and hit him with a cannon or an attack, the health bar updates. So that's what happened here. That's what we're doing. We're just plumbing, hammering him, and it looks like he has been dazed, and now he's up on the coast. So let's get over there and hit him with all we have. Sorely not prepared. I didn't even put on my buff. Let's do that. Let's get in our specials. Under his wing. <laughs> but what I can't figure out is I don't see how you can observe his attack on you. Like, there's nothing telegraphed. See, I just got hit. And I, I don't even know where that came from. So, the next time I do this, I'll keep an eye out for uh, what to look for before he does an attack. But thanks to all the fellow players here, it looks like Khan is uh, being taken down very quickly. Overall, 
really, really fun fight. There's lots involved. Monsters, cannons, you know, defending and getting the damage in on Khan. So what we're going to do is uh, show you what the rewards are, and then I'll uh, take you all the way back to port, and then I'll do my outro. <laughs> Epic music. <laughs> wow, he even could recover, but we were just more powerful than him on this day. the reward screen look at that I'm so close to getting uh, level 14 so this is the rewards that you get tears of the goddess very nice 4,000 con scale which sells very well Okila coins magical essence and Ayeli fragments overall very nice rewards very worth doing Especially for the Tears of Goddess at 4,000. Yeah, hello. It puts a dent in uh, the statue that's in your town or in your camp. So you can give your guys a, a buff. So let's go ahead and head back. And I'll just go ahead and dock. So I wanted to get this video out uh, as soon as possible so that... Uh, you guys who uh, are able to do it know what to expect, and those who aren't able to do it just yet will be excited to get in on this fight when they can. So we'll just put Archmage over here in, in the sunlight and say thank you. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you like my videos, please subscribe, like, let people know. I'm always making more videos, and there's plenty more to do. So until then... You have yourself a great day. Thank you. Take care. Bye now.